Hi, David Hall here. We have a gold and silver coin report and it's good to be back doing this. We're going to do it weekly because the market is definitely uh, picking up. Uh, in terms of the straight bullion price, uh, today we had a close of gold at 1187.50. So uh, actually gold is very cheap right now, as cheap as it's been in uh, several years. And we like that, but uh, that market, it's just a matter of time. Now you have interest rates going up, stock market looking a little shaky, uh, the world in a precarious place uh, in terms of some of the geopolitics. So gold's looking very good right at the moment and again we're going to do this weekly because the coin market has uh, shown uh, signs of turning around and prices are starting uh, to creep up there. Let's talk about gold and silver too. Silver is actually underpriced in my opinion uh, compared to gold but uh, the bargain in the gold price is the gold itself but also when you talk about the coins, the bargain is in the vintage U.S. gold coins. That's uh, pre-1934 uh, when gold ownership was made illegal. Uh, gold coins, which were money at the time, a source of international trade payments. It was real money. And those vintage gold coins traded a premium over the spot gold price. Today's price is 1187.50. And that premium has collapsed in the past two or three years as buyer attention has turned elsewhere. The stock market ran way up. Uh, people weren't really into gold coins. And that premium has been as high as 200% a few years back. And right now, bargain a bargain, we have, these are $20 liberties. They're, uh, uh, 0.9675 uh, ounces of gold, about an ounce of gold. Uh, this is a 1900, and here's a 1904, 1898, real gold, okay, about the size of a gold eagle. And we are selling them today at approximately 4.5% over their melt value, 4% premium. Unbelievable, the premium used to be 200%. If gold goes nowhere and the premium just goes up, you make money. And you know, the premium's not gonna go uh, to less than zero. So the downside is just really limited to any movement in the gold market with a lot, kind of a double play upside. Uh, and this is, it feels good to hold them in your hands. It's real money. The gold bargain of bargains. 4.5% approximately. By the way, we don't sell them on the website, so you have to call in and get a firm quote on it. And because it fluctuates with the price of gold, the price fluctuates like all the time. Another great bargain is graded. These are graded by PCGS, MS64. In other words, uh, choice uncirculated, uh, $20 St. Gaudens. This is uh, 1928. Uh, 1908, 1924, okay, and we're selling these at about 14% over melt. So it, it's almost like you get the rarity and the grading for free. A great bargain in vintage U.S. gold coins, the b gold bargain I've seen in many, many years. In terms of rare coins, that market's starting to pick up and yet prices are very low compared to where they were even just a year or two ago. And, and uh, dealer inventories are low. Uh, auction action is pretty hectic. It's kind of hard to buy coins. You gotta buy them one and two at a, a time. We do have some nice new things in, so look at our website or uh, give us a call. Uh, real bargains in the rare coin market right now. So, I'm here for you. Glad to answer any of your questions. You can actually email questions in info at davidhall.com 
dot com and I'll pick out the most kind of interesting questions and actually answer them on the air uh, next week. And in the meantime, uh, I'll try to answer some of your uh, emails personally. I promise to read them all. I can't promise that I, I don't know how many hundreds I'll get. Can't promise I will uh, answer every email, but send the emails to us, info at davidhall.com. I will personally uh, take a look and answer them for you and answer some of the more interesting ones uh, on the air. That's it for now, okay? As always, have fun with your coins, especially those rare coins now at today's prices. And by all means, buy some gold.